Every aspect of life adapting to the coronavirus pandemic, that now includes Palm Springs Pride coming up in November. News Channel 3's Jake Gracia is live tonight from home with new details on how this year's celebration will be different. Jake. Yeah, John, good evening. And it's a weekend meant to bring people closer, proudly uniting together. But in a pandemic, even Pride this year will be a socially distanced celebration. Eight to 10,000 people marching and walking in a parade with thousands of people uh, watching along the side of the road. That's what we do not have this year. Instead of the usual festival held downtown each year, the first weekend in November, Palm Springs Pride is taking a reimagined route this fall, trading in a community parade attended by tens of thousands for a socially distanced car caravan through the city. Same households can be invited to decorate their cars, make some signs, get dressed in costume, and, uh, and, and come together. President and CEO of Palm Springs Pride, Rhonda Hart, says safety is the top priority of this year's festival. Pride events normally create that community gathering, and we just can't do that in the time of COVID. So we really have had to rethink. And normally during Pride here on Arenas, this is one of the hubs of the city with a stage set up here and the entire street blocked off. This year is going to be unlike any other organizers say with no stages and no gathering, all to keep people safe. And our community will still have the opportunity to come together and be a part of something bigger. DeHart says this year's pride is important as it falls the weekend after the nation will have chosen a president. You know, we'll be celebrating or we will be mourning. Bringing the community together while staying six feet apart.